long since erased from the records of time. There once existed two European clans who served as overseers of history for the powers that be. The Umbra Witches, dwellers of the darkness, and the Lumen Sages, controllers of the light. The clans paid each other great respect, and their efforts to maintain the balance between them defended the just passage of time. Yet one day, that balance was toppled. Once harmonious clans fell into disagreement and stoked the flames of hatred against each other, resulting in an era of strife. The conflict between the Umbra and the Lumen threw all of Europe into a chaotic loop of battle, ambush, assassination, and casualty. It was truly a gruesome war. Despite the tremendous radiance of God shining upon them, the Lumen Sages were gradually weakened by the assault of the secretive Dark Witches. Years after the balance was lost, the war had ended in the Umbra Witches' favor. Their victory was short-lived. Fearing the witch's dark abilities, humans began to condemn the remaining Umbra. They launched the witch hunts, rounding up the battle-weary witches with little resistance and subjugating those who wished to continue the struggle. Human faith in the miracles of their god pushed the witch hunts further, and soon the Umbra witches, keepers of the darkness, were extinguished from the earth. All but one.
It looks like Humpty Dumpty's taking his last fall. Even Oleg Man the Destroyer gets scrambled in the end, right? You know, I still don't get why the hell you drag me out here for these things. I just drop off the merchandise. Hey, bet you can't guess what today is. Reading the good Lord's book ain't gonna do much. People been waiting for this asshole to get whacked for ages. Now, yeah, look around. There's no love lost for old Humpty Dumpty. But you gotta keep the outfit happy. We don't take care of him, they take care of us. And I prefer my shoes made out of rubber, not concrete. But hey, it's that kind of town. Without good hearted souls like us to put these bastards six feet under, where'd society be? Of course, the pay's not bad either. <laughs> Jesus, you really get into this shit, don't you? If it were me, I'd be praying he ends up barbecue. Or at least sunny side up. <laughs> you can keep praying, but the only way this guy's meeting the Lord is if God's hungry for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of hungry, we done here. My kids are baking me a birthday cake tonight. Cute little fuckers, I tell you what. Well then, adios. What the fuck? They're here? For this douchebag? I hate this damn light. I can't see a thing. Oh, but they're there, ain't they? You hearing me? You, you can see them, can't you? I see them. They are instruments of God, descending upon his heavenly rays to earth. Oh, my God. Dear Lord, grant us guidance and keep safe the souls of our loved ones for all eternity. Oh, yeah.
you look tired. Let me tuck you in. How about you get out of here? You die, and I'm gonna have to go back in that hole chasing after the money you owe me. Do you naughty little angels deserve a good banking? Beautiful. Bayonetta! This is cheeky, throwing me these cheap toys. Don't worry about quality. I've got quantity. Just gonna watch. I'm putting you two to work. That was your last call. No more shots from me, Bayonetta. Yeah. As long as there's music. I'll keep on dancing. Pumpy <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> 
Quit messing around.
It's against regulations, I tell you! <laughs> the damn thing! Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. Rodan should be paying me for even touching these toys. You have any idea how much this is gonna cost to fix? How the fuck do I always get wrapped up in this shit? Hmm. Engine still purrs nicely. Now, about this little thing you've been looking into for me, Enzo. Let's have a quick chat. See? This is why I told you I was going home. I just got held up in the air by some invisible things, and you want an intelligence briefing? It never stops with you! You keep belly aching like that, and you're liable to wake Eggman from the dead. And I don't think either of you would like that. Ah! Catch you later, Bayonetta. Something tells me you're gonna need a rush on our special project before this shit hits the fan. Wait, Rodan. What about... Eggman! Such a popular chap. I bet they hate him down there as much as you did when he was up here. We just need to make sure he won't come crawling back when they kick him out. Nothing a flower bed can't fix. Fill her up. You heard the man. Finish up in five minutes or you're walking home to your cake and candles. What?! Don't you leave me here! screwed in all this too of all the low-life scum in too deep in this town i've never seen one get wrapped up in a fight with god's messengers dressed like a nun too when you end up in the afterlife that's not going to be pretty i can't help it if i like the little outfits the toys are nice <laughs> Hey, hey, 20 years ago, you woke up stuck in a casket at the bottom of a lake. All you can remember is that you're a witch. But now, 
You're stuck, because you gotta sacrifice our Halo-wearing friends every day, or they'll drag your ass back down to hell. I know, I thought I got screwed, but being forced to slap around the Divine for a living? That's really getting screwed. If I needed a biographer, you wouldn't be my first choice. I see to the funeral. You get me the information I asked for. That was our deal. Ha 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 ha! Come on now! Look at my poor car! I'm working for free after this! At least let me get a drink at Rodan's before you start drilling me. The info I got is good. It's gonna get you close to finding the other stone in the pair and figuring out some of that lost past of yours. I swear. Cash, just like a girl. <laughs> Jesus, can't you take a joke? Enzo, someone's given you a present. Too bad. I can't stand bugs. to Bayonetta. All that sleeping made you soft. <laughs> Must 
Those assholes sure know how to get attention. Even perk the ears of the hotheads down home. You don't say. It's getting harder and harder to tell the worlds apart. Human world. Inferno. Paradiso. Who can tell the difference? Even harder with Purgatorio in the middle. Fight long enough in there and you'll really lose sight. Why the sudden interest in metaphysics? It's a balance, right? Even if some of them like messing around with the humans, we've all got a stake in the status quo. But people keep fucking around like this, the Book of Revelations is gonna look like Mother Goose. Heaven and Hell are gonna go straight for each other's throats. Heaven and hell can tear each other to pieces, for all I care. I've got my own problems to worry about. Something's up. Everything was a bit too brazen. And Enzo's tip makes the timing too perfect. This reeks of a setup. Someone in one of those lost memories calling you out. I got a little present for you. These babies are special. Built from an alloy the devil himself would kill to get his hands on. Don't break these, because they're one of a kind. Calling me out. I don't go in for strange offers. Then again, I'm getting a little tired of these weaklings they keep throwing at me. Maybe I should aim for something a bit more... high class. Pounding them down tonight, baby. 
Not to butt into your affairs, but I'm pretty sure you got somewhere better to be. The guys you're up against aren't the type to wait for you to finish a round. Enzo, her drinks are going on your tab, buddy. <sighs> you did beat motherfucker. Ah! So, I asked around, and some whale in Europe is trying to fence a huge rock on the black market. He calls it the right eye, saying it's part of some set called the eyes of the world. Fits the bill of what you're after, don't it? Now, here's the funny bit. The stone passes around the halls of power for hundreds of years, vanishes, and then the black market goes white hot for the thing. But the seller wanted an arm and a leg for it, to the point no one could stomach the price. So back goes the stone. But not before everyone figures out where the guy is. <laughs> You're gonna enjoy doing this one, I bet. I love sticking it to the rich. Of course, when you do, don't forget your old buddy Enzo stuck his neck out on this one. Slide me a few fuzzles out of the rich guy's pocket for my troubles, right? Anyways, you better get going before the trail gets cold. Off to the middle of nowhere. Paradise of Europe. Vigrid. So, this is supposed to be paradise?
I knew it. This town's teeming with heaven's little helpers. It's making my buddies downstairs awfully nervous. And your point is? Some places in this world are closer to Paradiso or Inferno. The rat hole of a town you and I live in is close to both. But the Bigridians, it got a special air about them. They're closer to Paradiso than anyone should ever be. And that shit just plain creeps me out. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to set up shop here and score me some halos. These stupid rings are worth a fortune back home. Since it seems you're spoiling for a fight, if you come across any of these, bring them to me, and I'll hook you up. <sighs> Another one looking to line his pockets. <laughs> I'm beginning to see why Enzo is so fond of you. Real cute. But let's get one thing straight. Your fights are yours alone. I'm only here to watch my handiwork in action. So don't get any bright ideas about coming to me for help. No. You get one thing straight. I'm not the slightest bit interested in the fact that you made these guns. If you get in my way, I will... How do the Americans put it? Oh yes, bust a cap in your ass. Right on, baby. Right on. <laughs>
had enough. <laughs>
Well, well. An Angelic Kim's Gold LP. Got your hands on something awfully rare, haven't you? That thing is the perfect bait to coax out some of Hell's uglies. One note hits their ears, and a damn who's who of Inferno comes pouring out of the inner circles. Then I can use them to breathe life into what I make best. Weapons of mass destruction. Tell you what. You give me that record, and I'll order up something so fiendish, angels will cry at the sight of it. I'll just have to pop down to the tropics for a bit, so take a load off. a little rude, but he makes up for it with charm. Be nice to him, okay? Yeah. 